Hi, this is Renee from the iPhone blog. We are at Macworld 2010 and we are talking to PayPal. Why are we talking to PayPal about the iPhone? We can go to PayPal.com already, but now you can only do with PayPal now. Well, so right now we're introducing a way for, if you're an app developer, you're making an iPhone app, and you need to be able to accept payments from within your application, we're giving you a library so that you can stick that library into your code and have PayPal take care of the payments. So, say you're, a, uh, say you're making a app that allows you to upload your pictures to Flickr, and you've got all these great pictures that you want people to be able to buy. Like it's a poster or a print or something. Right, yeah, I yeah. want to order a huge poster of it, or yeah, I just really like that picture you have in Shasta, and I'm going <laughs> to order um, a little wallet size picture, right? Maybe you make an iPhone app that pulls your pictures down from Flickr, and it says, I want to order this picture from this size, uh, and it's, you're going to charge me $10 for it. Yeah. Right, so you put the PayPal library into your little app that you've made, person picks the picture they want, say they, say they want the wallet size, it's going to cost them 10 bucks. Uh, we open up a little module, a little dialog box in there so that they can log into PayPal, um, take their payment, give you the money, close back our iPhone app or our, our library so that they're now back to your app and you've got the money and you can ship them their, their wallet size picture. And so it gives them a seamless experience for their user, they're not jumping out of an app to go somewhere and come back. Right, so you don't have to link them into Safari, you can stay within the application uh, and it's still complete the purchase. And also for them it's it's consistent across apps, so if the, if the poster app has PayPal in it and then the bookstore app has PayPal in it, they, they get used to using one interface for their PayPal. That's right. Yeah. Okay. And security is handled on your end? Yep, we'll take, we'll take care of it so that the the developer doesn't have to worry about taking a password or taking credit card information or becoming compliant. You know, they, they stick our library in there and we'll take care of taking the credentials and getting the, the money from the PayPal account to yours. And also they get the benefit of user trust for PayPal, so as long as the user, if the user has a PayPal account, they obviously trust you. And then in an app, you know, maybe they don't know the developer so well, but they know PayPal, it's a trusted brand for them. Maybe you could sell this for us. <laughs> All right, great. Well, thank you very much. I'm with Kenty from PayPal, and we are at Macworld 2010. So. This developer's got some pictures of uh, Victoria. They didn't give you Wi-Fi to it? Ouch. Do I need to blur out your uh, calculator? Yeah. later? It's fine. Okay. <laughs> you have a way of tracking how people try to use it after? <laughs> um, no, but I, I did do a blog post once where I, I did type in my...